Good day everyone. In this video, I'm gonna share to you the history of the Pavia town. The brief history of Pavia town. Pavia was officially founded in 1862. How the town got its name is unclear and has long been disputed. One theory has it that the name came from a certain colonel Pavia of the Spanish garrison in Iloilo who was supposedly responsible for initially establishing a Spanish presence in the area. Others believe that the name is a Spanish corruption of the Iligaynon word Bia Bia, as the area was originally considered a neglected patch of land that served mostly as a camping ground for city sophisticates and absentee landlords. Others claim that the town was named after a Spanish Governor General Manuel Pavia E. Lai. Marquis of Novaliches, who eventually became a priest after his short tenure in the Philippines from 1853 to 1854. However, this author believes that the more credible theory seems to be the overlooked fact that the town's religious well-being was placed under the jurisdiction and supervision of the friars of the Augustinian order and they simply named a place in honor of the town in Pavia, Italy, where the founder of their order, St. Augustine, was buried. The last theory seems to be supported by circumstantial historical evidence. It was also in 1862 that an independent parish dedicated to St. Monica was established by an Augustinian friar, Policarpio Minayo. But it was only in 1889 when construction of the famous brick church, as it now stands, began. It was envisioned and built in the Byzantine style with Romanesque design elements. Two Greek crosses dominate the facade, and the transept is round set against the rear wall. It is unique in the whole of Panay as it is the only church built entirely of red brick inside and out. Quite significantly, the church design was apparently inspired by the ancient royal Arca Basilica of San Michele Maggiore in Pavia, Italy. The Significant People and Local Heroes of Pavia Historical Town Pavia is believed to have been officially established in 1848. During the Spanish occupation, when 13 landowners decided to shape the future of what used to be a camping place, a settlement place, or an abandoned place. The 13 landowners were the following. First is Anacleto Hedriana. Second was Marcos Evangelista. Third, Barbarino Makiling. Fourth, Graciano Gonzaga. Fifth, one sure named Ramos. Sixth, one sure named Rimeo. 7th, one sure named Leocadio, 8th, one sure named Gregory, 9th, Mariano Makiling, 10th, Vicente Yechanova, 11th, Locario Hontanilla, 12th, George Agolino, 13th, Constantino Gumban. The first nine of those landowners are being immortalized, as nine of the municipal streets were named after them. The place being a camping place has been derisively referred to as Bia Bia, which means neglected or abandoned. It was believed that the town got its name from the word Bia Bia. Other version had it that the town was named after General or Colonel Pavia as to why should he be immortalized, it was not known. Geography of Pavia the photo is the map of Pavia. Pavia is one of the smallest municipalities of Iloilo with an area of 2,703 hectares composed of 18 barangays. The municipality occupies the central portion of Iloilo. Its borders are defined by the municipalities of Oton, San Miguel, Santa Barbara, Liganes, and Iloilo City. Pavia is within the second district of Iloilo. It is a 9.6 kilometers north of Iloilo City, accessible through the Iloilo Capiz Central Road. Pavia is a landlocked municipality in the coastal province of Iloilo. The municipality has a land area of 27.15 square kilometers or 10.48 square miles, 
which constitutes 0.54% of Iloilo's total area. Its population, as determined by the 2020 census, was 70,388. This represented 3.43% of the total population of Iloilo province, or 0.88% of the overall population of the Western Visayas region. Based on these figures, the population density is computed at 2,593 inhabitants per square kilometer or 6,716 inhabitants per square mile. The photo was population of the Pavia based on the latest census that was on 2020 and it's compared to the population on 2015 if how much change to the population of Pavia after 5 years. Pavia's culture. First is the Carabao Carosa Festival. Pavia, since 1973, holds the Carabao Carosa Race Festival every 3rd of May. The Carabao is made the king for a day and the race features Carabaos each pulling a bamboo sled or carosa on a 400 meter course. Carosas with native designs are also paraded as part of festivities. Aside from the Carabao Carosa race that was held during the morning of May 3, there is also a pageant called Miss Carabao Carosa held also during May 3 evening at our Pavia Town Plaza. The festival consists participants of 18 barangays in Pavia. Tigaralag Festival The Tigaralag Festival is celebrated in consonance with All Souls Day. The term Tigaralag comes from the Ilongo word Tig which means season of and Kalag, which means soul. Participants from the municipality's 18 barangays wear costumes and parade themselves from Barangay Aganan to the town's plaza for a dance drama. Competition with a storyline reflective of Tigaralag. Held every 30th day of October, the festival was conceived by Cecilia H. Capadosa in 1992. Recently, Bay Bunny Night was included as a side event of the festival in celebration on one of the town's industry, the Bay Baye. The Bay Baye Night was a side light of Pavia's 19th annual Tikaralag Festival. It was a competition to reinvent of this simple native delicacy using simple other ingredients that at first don't seem to match it. Bay Baye is also a famous cuisine or food on Barangay Kabugaw Sur as you can see when you are going to the Iloilo International Airport you can see on Barangay Kabugaw Sur along the road that so many stalls that selling bye bye. Pavia's Food Festival Pavia is also famous known as one of the best food festivals when incoming Festa of Pavia which is on May 4 and when incoming Christmas. Before pandemic, there's a lot of people coming to feast and watch some shows on our town plaza. Here's the references to the presentation that I made, the history of Pavia.